Good morning everyone, Buddy here from the Denman Homestead and I realized this morning that I didn't get any footage of setting up the uh, Christmas decorations on the outside. So, let me go plug these in. We've had rain the last couple days so I've had my lawn inflatables unplugged. Let me go plug them in I'll show you. Okay, so let's go check them out. We have the penguin that stole the snowman's head. Olaf, unicorn, the angel, which is our centerpiece. The goat, the Christmas goat, Jack Skellington, and of course C3PO and R2D2. These are the Christmas inflatables. Steph and I, a couple years ago, made those wreaths. Well, I mean, Steph made them, I just helped. But uh, we, we built them and put lights in them and everything, and then we hung one right here in that like peak right there. And they, they're on a timer, so when it gets dark, they come on and start lighting up. I need to find my Christmas flag. I still have the fall flag out. I got a Christmas one somewhere. There's the other wreath in that pit, uh, peak. And then Steph put together some little ones to go in all of our windows. And uh, this one on the front door, actually my mom, my mom got us for Christmas last year. there it's very pretty I've got some from when I got up early this morning before the Sun come up I got some footage of the back patio with uh, something new we're doing this year we've never really decorated the back patio but Steph wanted to do like some twinkling lights uh, red and white so I'll show you that footage right now with the tree in the window check it out So yeah, outside Christmas decorating. I don't, I don't, other than the flag, I gotta find the flag. On the inside, I think we're pretty much done with everything. Um, ready for December. I mean, it is December. It's the second day of December now, but we're ready. We got everything up. We're supposed to have like the next five days of sunshine, so these guys will be able to dry off out here because it has been wet. Yeah, that's Christmas stuff. Okay, let's go say good morning to the ladies, chickens. Oh, step into the barn for a second. We're just two weeks away. Two weeks away. Now that we're going to have some sun, I'll probably have... I know Connor is going to want to help out doing stuff. Connor, Connor's been killing it with the, uh, the Etsy store. He's... He has really enjoyed helping, and uh, he started off as our box folder. He would make all the boxes for us, and then he turned into the soap cutter. So now he's coming up with ideas of how he can be more efficient with his box building and soap cutting. But he'll want to help out with the barn too, so I'll probably get him to get the leaf blower once the sun comes up and blow off the slab. Get it all nice and pretty looking. Hey ladies. All right. You are hungry, huh? I'll go 
go ahead and let them out into their playpen too. Okay. We're gonna. What is that? Oh, it's a cat. Here comes my mom's chickens. I'm trying to figure out where some food is. Let's take a walk through the garden for a little bit. We had some pumpkins, two of them, but the chickens made a meal out of them before they uh, got big enough, unfortunately. Loof is still looking good. Basil, not much left. This one is holding on. This one's got some down in there. Not a whole lot of basil left. Do still have some peppers. Look, actually, some of these peppers are ready to come off. Oh, yeah. That's actually pretty good. Get some of these bell peppers. Might make put them in breakfast this morning. Not huge, but definitely ready to eat. Still have some okra, which most of our okra now we're saving for seeds. Letting it dry out so we can save for seeds. But look at the kale. Lord of mercy, this kale is huge. It's like full bushes. Need to harvest some of that for sure. Eggplant, man. Let's look at that eggplant. We had such a difficult time getting it started but it is rock and rolling now and look at this there's eggplant all up in there nice pretty ones too that's awesome this this walkway needs some work, but eggplant is doing great. For how difficult it was to get it started and the troubles we had with it, it is killing it. Okay. I'm going to grab some jalapenos too. Might just make me like an omelet this morning for breakfast. Let's get some jalapenos. Oh yeah. Oh, here comes Molly. Hey Molly girl, look how big she is, look how big she is. <laughs> Molly, you're a big girl, you're a big girl Molly. Miss Luna, you miss talking to Luna at the fence every morning? No, they don't miss it. They still talk at the fence every morning.
Molly. She has gotten big. <laughs> Luna, you're crazy. You're crazy. I know. Your friend. It's your friend. There's the milk goat. There we go. It's our bell peppers and jalapenos. Mm, mm, mm. That was a good, uh, good garden scramble. So I uh, we got the eggs from my mom, and then you know the stuff I picked out of the garden this morning. Just made a quick little scramble. And that was delicious. Brought Steph a bowl. She's working on some soaps right now, so we both had that for breakfast. Yeah, so um, nice and quiet around the homestead this morning. But thank you so much for joining me as we did some, uh, showed you the Christmas decorations and fed the chickens, hung out with Molly for a little bit, walked through the garden. But I will catch you guys on the next one.